Hello everybody, this is Toshiyagi from beautiful little island Okinawa, Japan. Well, this is a subject I shot it a long, long time ago when I was art school. Um, okay, this is the base image and also I have this image made by Adobe Photoshop use filter called find edges okay I'm gonna make from those two images to make some different creative image well let's get started I'm gonna make duplicate layer from this duplicate then uh, turn the base image now then I'm gonna smudge on this base image well uh, I'm gonna change the blend mode no more to darken for this line drawing type image now then I'm gonna work on this I'm gonna rename smudge okay now use smudge tool okay let's try this uh, drawing to gloaming Glo gloaming smudge um, let's go from well small area face make it smaller then smudge okay go for smudge on the edge of the line which is the line image this is the fine edge one I'm going to use it later but you still see now because uh, layer mode is darkened okay I'm not going to well I'm going to smudge some on face Okay, now I'm smudging little details with the small size of the smudge tool around the models. Okay, now use a little more bigger size of the smudge tool. Okay, now make it a little bit small, I mean uh, bigger to smudge background from our, this kind of hard lines of the concrete background use a little bit bigger size kind of too busy background so I'm gonna smudge it don't show much details like lines and, and stuff this dark lines smudge it so it doesn't bother uh, me to look at the picture see well you can go back anytime you want so just smudge it uh, doesn't bother that uh, this only the lines and stuff it bothers okay make it a little bit a little bit more bigger then smudge this about costume too a little bit more rough smudge about here too and also oops not again smudge no almost done for background also I don't know if I'm gonna show the edge of the photograph or the round I don't know but to just smudge it just in case if I'm gonna use this uh, make it bigger smudge it outside
Okay. Okay, pretty much done. Now what I'm gonna do is with this. Okay, I'm gonna show the base image. Then I'm gonna make mask on smudged layer. Make mask. Then invert mask. That's right. Okay, now I uh, I'm gonna reveal this mask with. Let's see, smudged brush was a gloaming. So drawing to gloaming, same brush, drawing to gloaming, same one. Let's get it, um, same brush and the smudge tool. Otherwise, I'm getting confused. So, same brush we're gonna use to reveal. Choose the white on brush, then size it's gonna be a little big, and also the opacity goes to uh, maybe 60 around 60 percent. I guess it's too small, huh? Okay, go up to more big size 80 percent. Now we are making that uh, mask on this to reveal this to see the smudge image. Well, make it largest size, 100% on the grooming brush. I will see the model's face of course, then outside it's gonna be. Well, I want more bigger size of the brush, otherwise, it's gonna take a long time to reveal this. So, let's find out on brush drawing, um, painting. Maybe it looks like a little big. These are Japanese stucco. What's this? This one has some kind of rough texture. Well, let's go first with this stucco. Okay, brush is stucco, painting to stucco. I don't know the name of that uh, English name, stucco or stucco, I don't know. Well, this kind of shape, this, okay. Now, let's go for a little bigger size. Okay, we see now texture also. Go for 50% or so. Show the rough. Make it a little bit smaller. Okay, yes, we see some overall image now. I'm going to change back to drawing and gloaming. That's right. And then make it a little bit clearer. I mean, more detail. Now I'm gonna make mask on this line drawing type layer, make mask, then I see the outlines with a square line and also model's face. We have black lines. These lines are too thick so I'm gonna mask to take this out on this which I'm using the same glowing now. I don't mind to have this outlines, so I just leave it this, this, but uh, this kind of black dot, nah, I don't want this. So just 
Check this out. Connect complete readout. Some but you don't want this in inside the face. Just keep it. I mean uh, hide it. And this too. Just keep these lines on hand. And this one's fine. But not inside. Like eyes and stuff. Okay, pretty much fine for black lines. Well, these are nice to leave it. Okay, now next we have the image, I mean the mask for each layers. Now I'm going to move this base image, which is sharp image, move in between these lines and smudge layer. Then I make mask on this too. Now reveal. I mean, uh, invert this, then check the white to reveal on this photograph, base image on this, show you. Now, uh, well, easy for you to see, maybe her face, okay, now, first I'm gonna hide that line image by black ink. So no blacks on her face. Now it's smudged image we are looking at. Now reveal on this base image mask. Choose the white since this mask is all black. So take the white, then small size. We're gonna re reveal. Oops, oh, we're not sh showing this. Okay. We can reveal. It's not smudged image now. These are photo image. Sharp. And also the texture of the mask on the smudged. We're going to take, re, uh, take that out too. Now you see on her face lines here. We can reveal same. On this layer shows nice skin on base image and here too I'm not gonna reveal everything just some um, because uh, when you smudge it sometimes you clean up I mean uh, smooth out the skin skin texture too so we still have a lot of little dark dot so I'm gonna hide same time on her face then reveal, change the ink to white, then base mask to reveal. So we see the clean image. And also his face, some little big, I'm not going to reveal everything, just 10%, 20% or so. Just you see the hand shape, nails and stuff like her hands too and also her hand not very clear but some showing more sharper his hands also then hair some this is fine curry curry hair shows okay now show the ma muffler and his i just want to leave this Texture mask some we show these eyes to be clear and you see some of their some of his eyes lips that's not clear okay we are almost down for now okay now what's next well I'm gonna add one more layer in between this base image and the smudged image. Add one layer, then I like to make some color on this image. Let's see. Choose that uh, same painting. I used gloaming, but what was this? Stacco. That's right. 
Okay, I'm going to go back to stucco. I'm using a painting to stucco for this revealed mask, big one. Go for same kind of texture too. Add some background color this time on this. Now choose orange, take this size. And it on here. Okay, now background. Right here. I was gonna change the layer mode, blend mode. Now it's overlay. Take this one too, and this mask. Well, okay. Just go back to normal. Let's add some more color or change some on this. Pasty down. We can do that too. Okay, before that, I'm gonna. Well, before I add background light, I mean the uh, layer, background, background color, I want to change some about their skin tone. Let's see. I may add the color balance layer to be more healthy color on this now like, oh I just changed the whole image huh um let's try I gotta go back to the color no that was this okay I'm not gonna do this so uh, well well, I'm gonna duplicate this layer and then go up here. I'm gonna delete this layer, but I'm gonna make mask though. Mask, then invert mask again. Not again, I'm, well, just simple airbrush, soft brush to choose. And on this mask, we go down about this. Her, you see the mask only her face. Okay, then I'm gonna change this color now. Color balance pencil. Oh, pencil means maybe. You mean just add some? Wait a minute. In this case, I guess it's not using mask. Okay, I gotta do it again. Now go back. Okay, I'm gonna change this whole layer now. Change color balance layer itself. I'm looking at her face. Looks good. Red and more yellow and then I'm gonna copy this mask only keep this image on this change the her face color it's gonna be this little bit yellow huh I, I guess I can I can't do it again huh and later oh I, again it's going back huh Okay, um, I'm going to add some red, I guess that's it, and then only mask, reveal that with soft brush, small. Okay, maybe I can, yeah, I can go this one too, to just reveal touch. So it's gonna go warm color onto these guys. Okay, now I just fix the color on here, layer mask, and uh, well, I'm gonna change the to rename color. Okay, warm color only for their face. 
Okay, now uh, I was touching this color, but uh, okay. I'm gonna a little bit touch a mask on here. This is a straight image too, all right? Okay, then this overall mask is this layer mask. So I'm gonna touch this mask a little bit more with the brush goes to drawing to which was it painting stucco in the way goes to small go more darker I mean uh, this layer reveal This I think is kind of too much showing. And also I'm gonna add some same stacko to go orange, same color. Mm-hmm. Okay. Now I'm gonna add some more um this color uh, use the eraser same uh, painting to which was that stack on same brush to take these out small right here same again Use orange brush to this background color. And I'm going to change the color to now again. Touch this. Okay, small. Now I'm going to reveal this layer mask more detail. Dark area to be more sharpened. Is that right? White on layer. And just a little bit touch. Give it more punch. Wanna see this space more, huh? In that case, I'm gonna open up this one too. That's enough. Now, start to see the sharp image because I reveal this mask. It shows more sharp image. It goes Nicely sharpened. See the sharpness shows more uh, some punch, punch to the dark side. Yes, a little bit better, I think. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Okay, I still touching this mask with same old stucco. Oops. Well. The color is nice, okay. I go add some more colors here. Use orange right there, just a touch big. Now, opposite color, a little bit small. Touch here. Okay, almost done. Well, this is the last image, I think. Yep. That's it for today and uh, thank you for watching my video. I really appreciate to support me and watch your video and uh, see you next time guys. Have a nice day. Bye now. Ciao.